Mountain Dew likes to put out energy drinks and I'm not complaining because I tend to like all of them. Good morning guys. How are you doing? I'm doing well. I've never tried this before <laughs> as the camera falls. Um, I'm on my way to my parents' house. I've been up for a while. A while, while. I went up over to Katie's work, brought her breakfast, or breakfast, I brought her lunch because she had like a meeting thing and she couldn't leave, so I surprised her with lunch. Now I'm on my way to my parents' house because we're going to figure out, there's like an ABS light thing issue with my truck. And sorry, ignore the camera. <laughs> and my one headlight's out. This is not working. I thought I'd be able to film and it'd be super awesome and convenient, but it's not flipping working. You're gonna fall as soon as I accelerate out of this. So I'm just gonna hold you a little bit. Holy line of garbage trucks. There's like seven garbage trucks in front of me. I would show you, but you can only see the back of the one. But uh, okay, anyways, I was gonna do an energy drink review. I'll just do it really quick when I get to my parents' house, but yeah, we'll just do it really quick, right? Right in my parents' driveway, we'll do it super fast. I've had, they have four of these. The Mountain Dew, their new Mountain Dew energy drinks, the Rise Energy, whatever that is. They are sugar, well, they have four grams of sugar. No calories, I don't know, we'll do it, we'll do it when we get there. But I did a review on one of them. It was really good. I drank another one the other day. It was really good as well. I forget what one it was. I I think it was the mango one. I don't know. I don't remember. But we're going to do the review on the pomegranate. Whatever this one is. So anyways, line of garbage trucks. Let's just, let's just acknowledge this. Oh, I thought I'd be able to film them because the light and they'd be turning, but they're not. And it's not like seven, I think it's like four. Oh, there's one, one turned. But yeah, okay, all right. Let's head to my parents' house. Parents' house, let's go to my parents' house. Now we're here. We're here for the thumbnail. Mountain Dew Rise Energy Pomegranate Blue Burst. Or maybe this is how it, I don't know. I won't know until I edit. But anyways, there's the drink. 25 gram or 25 calories, two gram. Jesus, four grams of sugar. How many? 180 milligrams of caffeine. Mountain Dew likes to put out energy drinks, and I'm not complaining because I tend to like all of them. Now, the reason I'm doing a review on this one is because, oh, look. All the information's right here. I just had to read it. Coffee equivalent to approximately, approximately two cups of coffee, 5% juice, zero sugar added, Zinc and vitamin C and vitamin A. How much vitamin C is in this? Wow, 100% of your daily. That's surprising. So anyways, pomegranate is one of my least liked flavored beverages or drinks or whatever. So that is why I'm reviewing this one because I might give you an honest opinion. It's pomegranate slash berry, blue burst, whatever. It smells like, it smells like berries. That's delicious. That's delicious, Mountain Dew. Mountain Dew, you cannot do wrong when it comes to energy drinks, kickstart, like soda. I mean, I love Mountain Dew. I don't drink it very often because it's absolutely horrible for you. And even though this has some like positive things in it, it's still not good for you. <laughs> it still is not good at all. But it tastes good. It tastes delicious. I would get this one again. This one's super good. Almost better than the other ones I've had. I give it a 4.8 out of 5 zombies. Highly recommend it. Okay, I'm going to go inside because my dad's been waiting for me. I'm running late, which I usually never am. I'm usually never late, and I'm running late, so I don't like it. But, okay, good stuff. Try it out. If you like Mountain Dew stuff, you'll like it. it. Has It tastes like a Mountain Dew type drink, and then it tastes like blueberry, and there's energy, and you get it, it's good. Since I am over here, a shed update, and you can probably tell from here what the update is. The window is in. Fancy double paned. 
Okay, let's go inside. So now it's completely insulated. Oh, it's actually cool in here. It's warm outside and it's cool in here. That's crazy. I thought it'd be hotter in here because it's hot outside. Nice. I like it. I like it. See, it's not a shed. It's like a mini house. Cause, see? Full electricity. We have a loft. I like it. I like the, I like the mini house, not shed. And then I don't think I mentioned, oh, I didn't film yesterday. My dad and I put the loft up yesterday when I was over here. This was a pain to put up by ourselves. It was such a pain. We had to lift it on like an angle because these brace beams, he put those in first. So we had to do it on an angle and I had to lift and he had to lift. It was, it was a pain. So yeah, that's up. Like I was saying, you could put like a little like beanbag couch up there or a love sack and then a TV. It could just be like a, I know that's not what we're using it for unfortunately, but I like it. And see, look at all these electrical outlets. We got them all over the place. We're gonna have like freezers and refrigerators and we're gonna have like a cutting board table in here. And there's the shed, not shed update. We still have to do siding and the flooring, and then we'll be done. Today's dinner is in a bag, or was in a bag, I should say. It's all out, though. We've got the chicken breasts, the rice, okra, pepper, onion, seasonings, corn, and crushed tomatoes. I've never had okra. Where's okra? The okra? Right here. Oh. Okra's good stuff. Demi glaze. Ooh, fancy. Peppers and onions cut up. The okra is cut up. Chicken is currently cooking. Chicken is done, pulled out to the side. Now I am cooking the peppers, onions, a little bit of butter, salt, pepper, some seasoning packets until those are ready and then I'm gonna throw in the okra and then the corn and then the tomato and then demi glaze. Okay, what did I do? Oh, I put the okra in, I put some of the other seasonings in, the rice is actually in here, two packets of rice and then the water, two and a half cups of water. Now I have to bring it to a boil, throw that in and then it just simmers for like 20 minutes. So yeah, almost done. Okay, everything is now in. Just needs to come to a boil and then it needs to simmer for a while. It's done. It's done. I always forget to film when I finish. Yeah, that's a leftover paper towel. Oh, it's all done. All done. All done. All done. Let me try it officially. Oh, it's probably, it's hot, huh? Is it hot? Ow. Everything's steaming a lot. It looks very hot. Oh, it's hot. It's really hot. It's good. It's hot. It's good though. Yeah, good night. Good night. Good night. We're almost done with the Harry Potter movies. We're on the second to last one. The first part of the Deathly Hollows. Yes. And they're all really good. I like them. I know that probably sounds weird since the movies came out like, what, 10 years ago or something? Mm -hmm. I don't know. But anyways, we're going to go to... What? Right, well, yeah, we're going to go to bed now. Thank you for watching. And good night.